Hello, and welcome to me not playing Purtle on Monday, April 25th, because as you can see, I have already played it. I got it in two guesses. It's Paul George. My first guess was DeAndre Hunter. But yeah, anyways, the past two Purtles that I've tried to record, so Friday and now today, Monday, I recorded the whole thing and didn't find out till afterwards when I was going to edit it that there was no audio because for some reason my mic wasn't working. I don't know if the cable wasn't connected all the way for some reason or something like that. I'm gonna take off my headphones. I just noticed I was still wearing these. But yeah, I don't know what the problem was. I'm still not sure if my microphone's working to be honest, but hopefully it is. And so since I've lost two days of Purtle now, Purtle videos that is, I decided to check out this thing called Sporkle, which is basically just this website with a bunch of trivia games. I'm pretty sure they have quite a bit of NBA stuff on here too. So in place of a Purtle video today, I'll just be playing this quiz here on Sporkle. Can you name the NBA champions, finals MVP, and playoff stats leaders for each season since 1980? This is just the first quiz that came up when I searched, or maybe the second. I think the first one was NBA teams, just naming the NBA teams, which would have been way too easy. So I don't know where to put my little face cam here. So in 10 minutes, I'm going to have to try to name all the NBA champs, finals MVPs, and playoff stats leaders. Okay. I wonder if that's totals or that's kind of a really random thing. I get like the champions and finals MVP, but then the playoff stats leaders, it's just kind of out of nowhere. I don't know. It's either going to be totals or averages. I'll probably be able to figure that out based on if like all the answers are on the teams that were in the championship, then it's probably totals. So that can help inform me on where I should go. Also, I'm pretty sure, at least I've seen on other quizzes on Sporkle, that on things like this, where you're typing in, trying to fill in a bunch of blanks like you don't choose where you're trying to answer for so if you type in an answer and it's also the same answer that would be in one of the other blanks then all of them get filled in so if i were to type the lakers then i would get obviously you know 2020 2010 2009 all the way down to like 88 87 85 82 as well so yeah to make it harder at least for the champions part and probably finals mvp i'm gonna start from the bottom and go up so let's do this so starting with the 1980 NBA championship, that is obviously the Los Angeles Lakers. All right, so that filled in quite a bit. And then 81 would have been the Boston Celtics. I don't know what I have to type if I, have to, okay, just the mascot. 83 would have been the Sixers. 89 and 90 would have been the Bad Boy Pistons. I guess I don't really need my mouse. Can have both hands on the keyboard. Um, 91 through 93 and then 96 through 98 is going to be the Bulls. 94, 95 is the Rockets. Hakeem. Uh, 99 would have been the first Spurs championship and we got all those. 2006 would have been the Heat with Dwayne Wade in his third season. Uh, 2011 would have been Dirk and the Mavs, Mavericks. 2015 was Golden State's first year, I believe. Yeah, definitely. 2016 was Cavaliers. Uh, 2019 would have been the Raptors. 2021, last year, would have been the Bucks. All right, so finals of MVP, MVP starting down at 1980. That was Magic in his rookie season, Magic Johnson. Okay, that filled in a lot. 81 Boston Celtics was not Larry Bird. It was C Cedric Maxwell, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Uh, 83, it would have been either Dr. J or Moses Malone, but I'm going to go with Malone first. Yep. 84 Celtics would have been Bird. 85 Lakers would have been Kareem Abdul. Going to have to type all this in. 88 Lakers was James Worthy. Oh, I accidentally typed just James, and that gave me all the LeBron stuff, but we would have got it anyways. Pistons. Isaiah Thomas uh, was 90. Yeah, I knew that. And Joe Dumars was 89. 91, obviously, Michael Jordan. I'm just going to go last name, Jordan. And then Olajuwon, Duncan, uh, then Shaq. Can I type Shaq? Oh, that works. I thought Kareem would work too. Pistons would have been Chauncey Billups. Uh, 07 Spurs, or at 06 Heat was Dwayne Wade. Then 07 Spurs would have been Tony Parker. 08 Celtics was Pierce, Paul Pierce. 2009 and 10 Lakers was Kobe. Can I type Kobe? Nope. Bryant. Dallas Mavericks was Dirk Nowitzki. Nowitzki. Yep. Uh, San Antonio Spurs in 2014 was Kawhi Leonard. Uh, 2015 Gold State Warriors was not Steph. I thought Steph for a split second, but it was not. It was Igudal Igudala. Okay. 2017 uh, Durant obviously in 18. Uh, 2021 would have been Giannis and Teto Kunpo. Okay. Points leader in 2020 
wasn't LeBron, maybe Anthony Davis. My next guess is probably, yeah, my next guess is going to be Jimmy Butler. I was this leader if I didn't see that up in 2021, maybe Drew. Yeah, 2019. And yeah, th this is totals. So I don't know if I already said that, but yeah, I can see that it's totals based off of all the names that got filled in. 2019, Kawhi. Oh, no, I already have Kawhi filled in. So it would, wouldn't would have been him. Rebounds leader, Marcus Saul. No, okay. Uh, Serge Ibaka. No, let's try Lowry for assists. No, okay. Van Vliet definitely isn't. No, who did? Okay, so they faced the Warriors, which I guess I'll put Curry. Curry hasn't done any of these things. Maybe Kyrie, no. Wasn't, uh, obviously not 19, but I'm trying to think of more names. 2019 rebounds. Between Marcus All and Serge Ibaka, I don't know who else. I mean, it would be somebody on the war. Draymond, maybe? Okay. Oh, and he was the assist leader, too. Okay, so 2017 Warriors. Wasn't Draymond as the rebounds leader? <laughs> I don't know. McGee? No. Oh, probably Kevin Love. Yep, Kevin Love. Uh, 2016 points leader was not LeBron. It was not Irving. It was not Curry. It was not Durant. It was not Draymond. Clay, because that was his crazy year. Yep. 2016 assist leader. Deli? I don't know. I don't even know how to spell Dela De Vadova. Dela De De Vadova? Probably not. Rondo? No, Rondo wasn't on that team. What am I thinking? Or was he? No, he wasn't. 2016 assist leader for the playoffs. I guess maybe, maybe it wasn't somebody in the finals. Who else was... Who else made it that far? Harden? No. Okay, Harden's not anywhere on here. Chris Paul. I, I didn't think he would be filled in for 16, but I got him for 14. Assist leader. 2016 in the playoffs. Man, I don't know. Like Sean Livingston? I have no idea. No. I'm trying to think of guys that were on those teams. But 2016, that would have been the Rockets and Golden State in the Western Conference Finals, right? At least I'm pretty sure. This thing is way up too high. No, it wasn't. To, what am, am I high? 2016, that would have been the, the Thunder. So Westbrook. Okay, cool. And I'm surprised he's only in one of these categories. Not anywhere in 2012, I guess. 2012 assist leader. Wasn't Dwayne Wade. It wasn't uh, maybe Derek Fisher. <laughs> I have no idea. Fisher. No. 2014 rebounds. 2014 rebounds. It wasn't Duncan because I already typed his name in. Kawhi, Durant, Ibaka. I've already, I've already tried Ibaka. Steven Adams wasn't there yet. Was he? And his canner might have been there. No. 2014. Why, why am I thinking of Thunder? Yeah, it was the Spurs and the Heat. Why, okay, maybe Chris Bosh. Wow, Bosh isn't on here anywhere either. Man, I might just lose out on all of these. I'm, I'm just going to have to start typing some names. Nash. I don't know. Vince Carter. No, he never made it that far in the playoffs. Dirk Nowitzki already did him. Tim Duncan. Kevin Garnett. I only have 20 seconds left. Man, I can't, I can't think. My brain is like stopped. Kobe Bryant. McGrady, McGrady, and I have no idea. Man, that was bad. Dwight Howard in 2014. Oh, on the Rockets. He would have been on the Rockets at that point, right? I wanted to type Rondo's name in earlier. Man, it was hard to focus. I was getting a call. Uh, somebody kept calling me during the last couple minutes there. But yeah, I need to go. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this was fun. I can play more of these sometime instead of Pirtle or both. Or when my Pirtle gets ruined, then I'll have Sporkle to fall back on. But yeah, uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.